We may ignore, but we can nowhere evade the presence of God. The world is crowded with it. He walks everywhere incognito. That's a quote from my favorite author, C.S. Lewis. And I find myself quoting him quite a bit. This particular series is about uh, Christianity specifically. My last series was what can be obtained by observing nature. In this series, um, I want to talk about Christianity in particular and Jesus specifically. So um, last series, I did five videos of about uh, 10 to 20 minutes a piece. And my plan is to do about that again. Uh, but the subject being, who is Jesus? And, and how can we trust the authority of Scripture? Because both of those go hand in hand. Most of the information that we have about Jesus can be found in the Gospels. And so if we, if we don't understand them as historical accounts, then we can't ascertain exactly, in my view, who Jesus was and what he was about. So, so this next series of videos will, will center on those topics. My name is Patrick Geraci. My website is trinitycounselor.com if you would like more information. I would encourage you to watch the first series of videos uh, to get a general background. What we talked about uh, in those videos is how we can trust that the world is filled with a personal, rational God. And, and so now we're going a little bit further and seeing where the connection is between uh, recognizing a personal, rational God and, and Jesus as God, since that is primarily uh, what defines Christians. Those folks who worship Jesus as God can be considered Christians. Folks that don't, they can, they can be considered um, something else. Mm -hmm.